Welcome back, you dingoes. We're gonna try to mow through it because I don't know if we're gonna have a chance in these games. But we are coming off a pretty good victory against San Diego State in last episode. Now is a good time for me to let you know that this video is brought to you by Manscaped. But we'll hear more from their glorious below the waist grooming products at halftime. Also, I forgot to mention in the last episode, it was our last home game against Wyoming. Jeremy Jimmy is actually the only senior we have on the entire roster. So, so much for a senior day for him. He really didn't do anything. Hopefully, he'll shine in his final game in this episode for the Dingoes. Who knows where he'll be after this. It's definitely not the NFL, that's for sure. We're getting to the end of recruiting this year. We already have 11 people committed to the team, which is solid, but we need some like defensive backs and receivers, skill position kind of things if we want to have any sort of success next year. So we got to get John Evans, William Jackson, Chris Richard, Reggie Brantley, all these guys. And then we have a bunch of fringe guys who we're still in the lead for, but we got to pick up the pace if we want to get them committed. Essentially, if we're not in the lead for somebody or we don't have a chance to jump to the top, of their list i don't see a reason to go for him like john smith we're very close 90 points behind we can stay on his board i'll put 50 more points on him and if you couldn't tell already i'm still sick in this episode i'm recording it right after the previous episode a little bit under the weather but i'm powering through don't you worry still rocking the number one rush defense in the nation it's a little bit of a fluke because we play like the shorter quarters and that tends to happen a lot in this game but it's still a fact so there you go Ooh, those are some nice uniforms really dig this stadium actually simple clean got some interesting lines all over the field somebody must be playing either like lacrosse or soccer out here maybe both so last game we threw an interception on our first play let's not do that jt martinez we got it to alex king completed a pass that's a good start and because i'm trying to get through these games fairly quickly i'm turning on the conservative clock once again can you really blame me we got the tight end, that swatted away. Thought he was gonna stop, but he ran to the corner. We got him. Dick Boulder makes a great catch. Oh, go, go. Cut back in. Ah, oh, that was a disaster. What the heck was I doing? Uh, We got Jacob Hill, but that's horribly off the mark. Come on, man. I don't see anybody. I don't have any option here. That's going to be a massive sack. Fourth in 30. Larry Lumpkin. We got sacked by a guy named Larry Lumpkin. Hit the ground. Get us a lucky roll. He caught it. What a grab. How the heck do you catch that? That was a bullet straight to the dirt. Trap him in. Amazing pursuit. Just ran around the blockers. That's AK-47 with the TFL. That's a handoff. Can we get there? Yes. Took like three of us. Another TFL for the Dingoes. He's throwing it. Easton Gorman turning around and swatting it down. That'll be fourth and 13. Their kicker is one of their best players, so I expect him to make this one. Oh, it's going to be close. And he gets it through. Nice kick. Oh, we got Alex King wide open. We got a block on the outside. Spin move. He's been hot today. Oh, they got the QB contained. That was weird. JT Martinez somehow avoiding that tackle. We got Alex King open. Keep finding AK-47. He's the most consistent receiver we've got. And he's not even a receiver. Oh, did we beat him? Jacob Hill diving catch. He hasn't had a catch in ages, but that one's 40 yards. That's got to be as far as JT Martinez can throw it. Jacob Hill, give me a hug, buddy. What a catch. On the run, Easton Gorman touchdown. Dingoes take the lead. Couple of huge plays from Alex King and Jacob Hill, and we're back in this ball game. Throws it across the middle. Can we make the tackle? Way to go, Bill Dingle. <laughs> the small victories. Look, I didn't even expect one win on this first year. If we somehow pull out three, this would be crazy. Oh, no. Jesse Shelton whiffed. That's going to be a touchdown. 
crap. I have conservative tackling on every game too. It's still not enough. We're just too low of overalls. Eventually, they're going to get a big play. Oh, we got circle. Seth McKenna, holy crap. Keep going. Oh my God. He's going to go the distance. That's got to be play of the year for the dingoes. You can't make it up, buddy. He juked out like four people, broke another tackle. One of the fastest players on the team takes it all the way. Got to see that one again. Seth McKenna. Oh my God. That's insanity. 14 points in the first quarter. The dingoes are here, baby. The dingoes are playing well. High five that man. Slap his booty cheeks. All that good stuff. What a legend. If that play doesn't get you fired up, I don't know what will. 75 yards from a team of walk-ons. Absurd. Oh, they fooled us. I thought it was going to be a screen pass. We're lucky we tackled that guy. Oh, I whiffed. Thank you, D.D. Rogers, saving our butts. Alex King hits him, and we make a good play on the ball. Timothy Dickens popping it out. Oh, no. Tony Gallo got beat, but dude dropped it. We are so lucky, bro. Big fan. Big fan. They're got to be faking it, aren't they? Yeah, everybody cover. We're ready for the fake. You can't fool us. They're scared to lose to the dingoes. Yeah, of course they're faking it. Got old dude open, but we bring him down. You tried to fool us, Nevada. Not today. We keep playing like this, boys. I'm just going to stay sick forever. Maybe that's the good luck charm. Oh, 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 oh. Well, yep, of course we're going to fumble it. They get it. That was such a long play. Martinez broken tackle after broken tackle. He was gassed eventually and he lost the football. Like he was hit so many times I didn't even have time to slide at all. Oh, he fooled us on that one. Introverted Veer. He's got a blocker. Oh, Jesse Shelton fights through it and tackles him. Screen pass. Oh, almost picked that off. If Oliver McIntyre could catch something, dude, we could add a pick six. Going up the gut. We got people there. Neil Kraus. Oh, Easton Gorman again. Second deflection of the game for him. Gets the kick. 14 to 13. Everything's all right. Still got the lead. We had a fumble on last drive, so let's try to not do that this time. Let's hit the running back. Not bad. Four yards. Better than a turnover. We got Alex King, my favorite target. What a play. <laughs> We're getting so lucky on these animations. Almost 200 passing yards in the first half. It's going to be a career game for Martinez. I'm throwing it. Dick Boulder's got it. We're taking chances deep and we're completing it. Time to scramble. Look at this running room. Going to slide down. We're going to not fumble it. This man's going to get MVP this game. Guarantee it. All right, I'm running. Actually, I'm throwing this one out of bounds. Live to play another down. Oh, we got Joseph Davis. Can he get there? What a catch. Martinez magic is here this game. Usually it's his scrambling that gets it done, but he's throwing some beautiful passes right now. Heck, I'm, I'm about the Martinez magic. We can get another victory. We got square Jacob Hill touchdown. Fit it between two defenders. 12 of 15, three passing touchdowns. For JT Martinez, this is going to be the best game on offense for the Dingoes all year. Firing on all cylinders right now. Yeah, he's scrambling. Oh, come on, McIntyre. That's your sole job to watch the quarterback scramble and you still failed. He's not open. He's trying to run. We hit him, but he gets the first down. Oh, we whiffed. D.D. Rogers is getting stiff-armed. Thankfully, we pushed him out of bounds. Oh, picked up the block late. Oh, I whiffed. Easton Gorman, great. Jeremy Jimmy. Okay, okay. 
Nobody's open. We got him. Team effort right there. I'm going to call a timeout. I believe we can stop him. Oh, we hit the quarterback. Dude dropped it again. I think that's the same guy who dropped it earlier. Oh, we got another kick up. Oh, it's off the post, but it goes in. I thought he missed it for a second. 21 to 16 right now. We got a five-point lead. What a kick. You got to see that one again. Boinking off the post right there. One minute, 11 seconds ago, we still got two timeouts in our pocket to try and drive down and get some points before halftime. Let's get it done. They're blitzing. Got to keep this pace up. Oh, we beat him deep. Dick Boulder, he's still going. He broke another one. Let's go. Make that 250 passing yards in the first half for JT Martinez. Making the Nevada defense look silly. This is the best we've played all year. Got Dick Boulder again. He grabs it for another first. Two minute offense. We only needed like 15 seconds. Tight end. Oh, spin move. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and burn that timeout. 32 seconds to go. We're sitting in a great position. Oh, we got Jacob Hill over here. Come on, turn up field. Oh, that's losing a yard. At least you got out of bounds, but come on, buddy. Back of the end zone. Oh, my goodness gracious. Almost picked off. I'm going to kick it right here so we go by, what, like eight points? I don't know. I'm bad at math. Sink it. It's just a chip shot. He got it. I think Justin Fowle... Again, is still perfect on the year. Could not have asked more from this kid. Oh no, there he goes. Not like this. To end the first half, he's going to return the kickoff. Ugh. How many games in a row have we given up like a punt return, kick return, all the returns? They're going to go for two to try to tie up this game. Keep him out. I want to hold on to this lead. And we sack him. Let's go, Alex King. Keeping the two-point lead for the Dingoes. Oh, I'm getting sacked. Let me call that timeout real quick. Didn't really make the best of reads there, did I? Larry Lumpkin sacked me again. Going into the locker rooms. We got a two-point lead. I'm ecstatic. JT Martinez, almost 300 passing yards, three touchdowns in the first half. He's balling out. Second half should be a fun one. Now that it's halftime, let's hear from our sponsor, Manscaped. All right, gentlemen, it's time we have a talk. It's Swamp Nut September, and the best way to combat that killer ball sweat is picking up some high-quality products from Manscaped.com. They've got the ball deodorant in the crop preserver and the ball toner in the crop reviver. You can get both of these ball fresheners bundled in the Perfect Package 2.0 alongside Manscaped's signature Lawnmower 2.0 Nut Trimmer. The Lawnmower 2.0 is wireless, waterproof, and will shave your biscuits without any threat of nicks or cuts thanks to their ceramic replaceable blades and skin-safe technology. Not only do these blades move at over 6,000 RPMs, but you can get a whopping 20% off all these products I've mentioned when you use my coupon code NTE20. Once again, that's code NTE20 for 20% off. Act now and they'll throw in this sweet shed travel bag for free. Thanks again to manscaped.com for sponsoring this video talk about seth mckinnon and that massive 75 yard touchdown we're not gonna be able to recreate that ever again maybe next year or something but this year no way oh another dud you're killing me blaze you're killing me oh my god he got thrown off so hard we're not gonna be able to catch this guy a shot out of a cannon, dude. I feel bad for whoever got knocked to the ground right there. Jay Robinson just punched him in the mouth. Oh, that's Neil Krause. Yeah, he's he's got to be out cold. He won't play the rest of the game. He's got a concussion. 100%. They're keeping their offense on the field to try and make this, what, like a six-point game? Everybody play some tough defense. He's trying to scramble. Oh, he follows it, and we stop him. That was so close. I thought they were going to pick that up and run it in. Four-point ball game. Oh, what am I doing? Can we escape it? Holy crap, JT Martinez. Slide down, buddy. What a play. <laughs> we should have got sacked for like negative 20 yards. But he escaped the pocket. Looking like Carson Wentz out there. 
I'm throwing it deep. Jake Boulder's got it. 35 yards downfield. He underthrew it, but it was just like Bo Nix's pass. It was meant to be underthrown. The miraculous throws deep for Martinez. He's so tired. He's out of the games. So we're going to probably run this football right here. Or we're going to hit. Nope, that's a hit in the ground. Eh, worth a shot. I'm not going to force that deep. Pretty ashamed that I have to get sacked, though. Uh, yeah, that's not going to be completed. Fourth and 16. What do I do? Do I punt it? Yeah, so let's punt it for the memes. Fourth and 16, that's pretty far. And this is pretty optimal short field for Blaze Bortles. That's a little short. Oh, the other dude caught it. I don't think he was the main target. Dude's wide open. Oh, no. Come on, Dingle. Way to recover. He's scrambling. We bring him down. That's Timothy Dickens. He's scrambling again. This dude loves to scramble. Jesus. Oh, dude's wide open. The corner route. We weren't expecting that. We thought they were going to throw it short. They're moving ahead by two scores here. What a darn shame. Screw their bald cheerleaders and their push-ups. We're going to come back and win this game. Yeah, hit the drags. Those are usually safe routes to build confidence. Oh, yeah. I'm not surprised you dropped that. That was a little, a little forced. Now we got that running back. Nobody's near him. Go out of bounds. Sweet. Oh, I'm going to run. Oh. <laughs> Just ran into my own guy and it kind of worked out for us. Uh, I'm going to hit X. Holy cr freaking leaping linebacker. Dude was nowhere near the football. You have... That's infuriating. That should not be a pick. The dang NCAA games were so cheesy with this. I'm trying to remain positive, though. We still have a ton of football left to play. We just gotta, gotta make a stop, and that'll get us back into it. Oh, that's not gonna get you a stop. Wallace beating us deep. Need more pressure on the quarterback. Can't get away with staying back there and trying to cover forever. We got that tied in. Joseph Davis breaking through, getting a first down. Sweet. Oh, I got hit as I threw it. Come on, O-line. You've been so good today. Throw it deep. Get there, McKenna. No, he dropped it on the hit. Dang it, I thought we had it. We need a miracle here on fourth down. Somebody get open. Oh, no. Scramble around. This is a nightmare. I gave them the ball in good field position, too. That's deflating. Well, they are certainly in control of the game now. Can we force a turnover? Okay, no. I thought I had the angle, but he scores a touchdown. Poop. We were doing so well in the first half. How are we falling apart this much? Oh my goodness. Oh, line, give me some time to throw it. I Like, I don't understand. We, we were doing unbelievably well in the first half, but now we are just crap. That one's doo-doo. Bro, somebody help me. Oh, there we go, Dick. Move in the chains. I don't see anybody. Oh, my goodness. Look at the effort from Martinez. He wants to win this game, even though we're down by a crap ton. On the run. He completes it. Gets out of bounds. Just straight willpower from Martinez. We got Antoine Goodwin. Oh my goodness. He gets destroyed. But he's got the football. That's all that matters. 400 passing yards for JT Martinez. Oh, and he's going down. I'm just going to let this go to the fourth. Martinez is probably going to be down. Is he injured? Certainly hope not. Antoine Goodwin the rest of the way. Hopefully he can manage something here. Well, that should have been picked off. These dang linebackers, man. Oh, he finally found the open man. Nevada drops 50 on us. 
Go deep, Easton. In stride. What a play. Just lobbing it deep. Oof. I took forever to read there. Great block. Great pickup on the ground. 12 more for JT Martinez. Take off. Look at that space. Gonna get to the corner. Stiff arm him. First and goal, Dingoes. Gotta love the fight in this kid. Even when the game's lost, he's still trying his hardest. Up, oh, scramble to the corner. Go, Martinez. Touchdown. Tacking on another touchdown to his name. He's had a hell of a performance despite us losing this game. And we score our highest total we've scored all season with 31 points. Small improvements every week, I tell you. Small improvements every week. And that one guy in the end zone, did you see him cheer? And he was like, yes, we got the extra points. And that's ball game. I thought we had a chance. We looked amazing in the first half. A lot of huge plays, some decent plays on defense, but we just crumbled in the second half. Couldn't get it together on offense and absolutely could not stop them on defense. Despite the loss, I felt like we played pretty well. A lot of moments in that game, especially from JT Martinez, and that got us an upgrade for BJ Hale. What a performance. Career game for JT Martinez. 25 of 42, 447 passing yards, three touchdowns. The only reason we got a pick in this game is because their linebacker went Super Saiyan and leaped into the air to pick it off. He also got 33 yards on the ground and another rushing touchdown to his name. Have yourself a day, Dick Boulder. Six catches, 139 yards. Seth McKenna, a 75-yard touchdown. The biggest play for the Dingoes all year long. It's going to be one to remember. That's going to make his highlight reel for sure. Jacob Hill and Easton Gorman also grabbed a touchdown in this game. Timothy Dickens led us with nine tackles, three of them for loss. How many sacks? One sack, and it was from TD right there, Timothy Dickens. Alex King kind of falling down in this one. Only two tackles in this game. How about that? 479 yards of total offense. Dang it, man. John Evans still hasn't committed to the team. This man's really waiting till the end of the season, isn't he? Making me super nervous. All right, we got another upgrade for BJ Hale. I'm going to add that to my closer thing for his recruiting. So we get 500 extra points through weeks 8 through 15. Or maybe I can throw it at the opener so I can add more points at the beginning of next year. We definitely get more out of it next year. So maybe that's the move. Pretty significant lead on John Evans now, but I don't understand why he won't just commit already, man. Clearly, the Dingoes are the best option. William Jackson. I'm afraid we might not get him. He's just been in this battle for so long. Hey guys, future me here, the one that's not sick. So this was supposed to be a doubleheader episode, but uh, if you saw my post on the community tab, the doubleheaders just take way too long. I think I'm gonna stick with one game per episode from here on out for the Dingoes. This will allow me to bring in more video games of different kinds, like NBA 2K, I got a series plan for that. And also it just gives me more free time in my personal life, which I desperately need for my mental health sake. So hopefully you guys understand that. But anyways, I wanna say thank you guys so much for watching. You're all legends in my book. And as for me, I am Drew Morris, big old Drewski, not the expert. And I'll see all you guys in my next video. Peace. Thank you to Patreon supporters Logan Pogue, Adrian Felix, Niall Patterson, Derek Brabham, Christian Herzner, Dean Young, Matthew Paul, Name Name, Zach Roden, Cameron Tipton, and Josh Caster.